I want you to make some connections, some mathematical connections for just a minute. So I want you to think about these numbers with me for just a minute. Think about the number 100. If I was going to raise 10 to a power to get 100, what would I do? 10 to the what power makes 100? It would be the second power, right? Okay, very good. Why? 10 times 10 makes 100. All right, what about if I went like this? What if I said 1,000? Then what, what would it be? 10 to the what? Okay, now there's some magic here. Watch this, watch. 1, 2, 10 to the second. 1, 2, 3, 10 to the what? Okay, so that's, that's pretty intuitive, okay? Watch this. What if we go to the number 10, then if I wanted to convert that into scientific notation, I would say 1 times 10 to the, to the what? Just look at the places that I'm having to move it. How much is it? 1 times 10 to the 1. Okay, so if I had the number 1, then, then that would be 10. There's no place to move the decimal, right? So since there's <coughs> zero places to move the decimal, <coughs> it's 10 to the 0, right? Okay, so watch this. What if I had 0 0.1? Then how would I put that in an exponent? I would have to move it move the decimal until there was one whole number in front of the decimal, but I would move it the opposite direction. So it wouldn't be a positive number, instead it would be what? It would be 10 to the minus one. Okay, what if I had this right here? What if I had point zero one, one two? I moved it two places, then it would be 10 to the negative two, okay. What if I had this one? one, if I went one, two, three, then that would be 10 to the negative what? Three. three. Okay, now here's where I want to kind of link this into your metric system. 10 to the one is deca. 10 to the third is kilo. 10 to the minus 1, do you know what this one is? Say it out loud. Deci. And so 10 to the negative 2 is what? So if I want to know how many centimeters in a meter, there are 100. And what would this one be here, 10 to the minus 3? Milli means 10 to the minus 3. So. It is a mathematical thing, but I'm asking for you to be able to identify a millimeter with one thousandth. That's another way to look at this. One thousandth. Okay, that's point zero zero one. That's ten to the negative three. That means all the same thing. What would this one be? One what? Help me out. What is it? One one hundredth. Point zero one ten to the negative two. What would deci, deci be? One tenth. Okay. So that's what I want you to kind of think about that all of these things mean the same. And see if you can kind of link these together. And when we talk about the metric system and we talk about milliliters, a thousand milliliters in a liter, or we talk about a thousand meters in a kilometer, then it's kind of nice to be able to link all this stuff together. And even though in this class we don't do a lot of mathematical calculations, math is the language of science, so it's important to know it. Thanks.